Hello everybody. This is Georgie and um it's time to begin Napoleon. It's a beautiful Saturday day. No, just joking. I was supposed to have this up on the weekend, but what you gonna do? It's not the weekend, it's Tuesday. Darn it, Georgie! You've done it again! You fail! You fail! Maybe I do. Yeah, you'll be seeing that a lot where I accidentally double click on things because my mouse is weird. But uh, I'm gonna change this to a uh, cantonment. No, no, theater. Cantonment. Yeah. Right, so I'm playing as Norway, as most well should know. Nice hats and stuff. Uh. I'd like to thank, uh, real quick, Surreal Beliefs. I'll link his channel for drawing my attention to this wonderful mod called Darth Mod, which is allowing me to play as this country in the first place. I'll set, it, I'll put in a link to both the forum page and um, uh, the um, to Surreal Beliefs' uh, channel. <sighs> right, I have no idea why I just had to. Yawn. But uh, it's going to be a little bit uneventful for the first few turns because I'm going to have to build a cantonment and then after that I have to build some troops and then we'll be able to start doing things. But, um. First, we need to get trade agreements. Uh, let's see. Batavian Republic likes us. Let's try to get. Nope. Mm -hmm. Oh, one second. Like I always do. For some reason, I always have to cough at the beginning. Um. Eclipseburg. Yes. But we don't have any uh, open trade ports, and tr the port we do is a military port, so I think I should trade change that to a trade port for now. I think that'll be it for the first turn. Like I said, it's gonna be a little boring at first. Um, but after a while. Uh, it'll be all right. The if you see countries in here that aren't in vanilla, it's because they're emergent. They're not supposed to be there. Like I said in the update video, um, because I'm playing as um, an emergent faction, uh, I um, don't have. Um, I I have more. Um, I have more countries on there than just the. And if they go hire a general, I always do that, but I can't right now because I don't have an army, so just trade some militia then. How much do we have until that's the two two turns? Alright. Do we get trade with uh Sweden? Trade. You are an idiot. Wait, wait, whoa, 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 whoa. Does that mean that okay, never mind, never mind, Sweden, you are not an idiot. You can struck a good deal. See, look how much it's going to take for us to take Sweden's capital. I mean, seriously. I mean, look at that. Just just look at it. Oh my god. S Denmark is another one. Because look at that. Look at that. The Kingdom of Denmark, Norway. Liar. Right, we have to kill them just because they're called the Kingdom of Denmark, Norway, because we can't have them lying like that. They're lying to us. They're telling us that they rule Norway, too, but no. No, it's us. Alright, the end of that turn. It feels good to do another Total War LP. I hope I don't get slaughtered like I did at that Takeda one I didn't upload. Um... Oh, where did that go? Right, so this is going to begin a series of Total War LPs I'm hoping I can run through. I mean, I I really shouldn't run a bunch of total, a bunch of LPs at once. But the thing is, I just I get bored really easily. I'm one of those people. So, I just I I want to, you know, I want to I want to upload what I feel like uploading. What games I feel like let's playing. And, you know, stuff like that, so that it's both, you know, good for me and for you guys. But, um, 
you know, all, you know, 26 of you or something like that, last time I checked. Um, but, um, my, um, but I, I just, I don't know, so I just get bored, uh, pretty easily with my, um, LPs, so, to remedy that, I'll be starting up, I guess, this, something in Empire, something in Empire, I, I actually might do, just say no to heck with Empire, and do the, f and see if I can find, well, if I can find a good French Revolution mod for Empire, I know there's one coming out for Napoleon, but if I can find one for Empire, I'll do that, because I don't know why, but I'm just obsessed with the French Revolution right now, but, uh, Napoleon, eh, but, uh, and I am going to do a Shogun 2 one, except it's going to be vanilla and no mods. But, um, yeah. I have Empire Total Factions on. I'll probably let's play that. I don't know. I just feel that that I don't know what to play if I play Empire Total Factions. I mean, I could play as Quebec, but that would be kind of weird. As Quebec. Or Mexico, maybe. Yeah, I don't know. Mexico. I, I don't know, I don't know. That just sounds, I don't know, weird for the time period. I don't know. I don't know. I could do the Warpath campaign. I don't know. But yeah, now we have Light Dragoons and Light Infantry. Now, you won't see many unique units for the Norwegians because they are a an a, uh, emergent faction. But, uh... We will be seeing Norwegian ski troops leader. A uh, leader? Leader? No, later. Because, um. We will be seeing the glorious Norwegian ski troops later because we are Norway. Do, 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 do. Right. Uh. You want to trade with us, Napoleon? No? Okay, then have some China. Yep. Wow. That really... Napoleon! Man, that... I give him a piece of chinaware and instantly he loves me. Now I got the darn love me as no there... As no there were no tomorrow... As though there were no tomorrow song from Fallout New Vegas stuck in my head. I should let's play that, but there's too many... Ow. Hit my hand on my desk. I should let's play that, but there's too many darn let's plays of it out, so... I, lo I love New Vegas, though, and I should be getting Skyrim in the next couple of weeks, which makes me very happy. I find, and the first thing I'll do, and I'll upload this, what I'll do is I'll shoot, I, I, when I get a bow, when I get into a town, and a guard says, I used to be an adventurer like you, but that I took an arrow in the knee, I'm going to record myself shooting him in the knee with an arrow and saying, Ha! Who's laughing now? It'll be glorious. I've also tried to say more things in my videos, and I just kind of, you know, drone on and on and on about my videos, or about, you know, if I have any time to record or anything. But I'm finally free, hopefully, for a long time. <laughs> but yeah. And hopefully I'll be able to upload for more than two videos a month. That was That was pretty bad. But, uh, you know, I, I upload when I can. Uh, and when I feel like it, of course. I was just playing some EU3 with a friend, but something happened, and he just randomly went offline, so I just, you know, just decided I'd go offline on Steam myself and play some of this. Do a Let's Play. Time to time, I try to make sure that my uh, that everything's good. I'm very happy about my uh, I got a new graphics card. That's why I'm able to bring you this let's play because without my new graphics card, I would not be doing this let's play right now. What the heck? Oh, fiddlesticks! I forgot to turn up the unit size. 
Oh, ho, 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 I'm not going to be able to live with this. Well, fine, fine, fine. If it gets really annoying having units of 45 in the Napoleonic Wars, I'll change it. But right now, I, uh, that makes me kind of angry. I should have seen that, too. It's, it's mostly an aesthetic thing. But, oh my god. I mean, squad warfare doesn't come for another. What is it? 1805 is so like 130 ish years. 120 ish years? I don't know. Somewhere around there. Um. Do 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 right over there do 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 Holy crap, let's handle the part. Now now let's swim away. Do 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 sorry sorry sorry. Alright, I'm done humming the chant to do the part, I swear. But Denmark will be our target because Sweden has two provinces and I wanna mess with people with two provinces and get really annoying. They both have full stack armies, which annoys me. Freaking full stack. Norwegian few. No, I draw the line! The line, you see, I'm drawing a line right here. They're liars. They're trying to be something they're not. And we'll name this the Christiania. Christiania? Oh, the Christian. Brief cameos by some people I know on a of uh, on a uh, YouTube. Right. You can figure out for yourself what those cameos were. <laughs> Ireland. Of course I'll accept trade with you. Why? Because Ireland's not really doing anything. Oh, Scotland lasted for a long time, now didn't they? I think I'll go for half, about an hour, 50 minutes of this. Then I'll go search for some mods to do um with Empire. And then I'll upload some more Napoleon, maybe. It's only been a f like 15 minutes. It's kind of horrible for me. Um, actually, I'll keep these guys over here because I want to take them out as soon as that happens. And we'll go... To Denmark, so take some Danishes, or just fight the Danish. Oh, the Russian Navy. Dmitry Senyavin. My god, he looks like he means business. Oh my god, that guy looks exactly like him. L look at this, look at this, look at this. See, 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 look. Algot. Are you ready, are ready? Holy crap, only that guy's just a little bit better. Back 
to Norway. Yeah, it's it's a little annoying that the uh, that the voices for the Norwegians are the voice is Danish, but whatever. I mean, it's not Danish; it's uh, German. I mean, they could at least give him the Swedish uh, uh, voice because at least that's Scandinavian. But whatever, whatever. At least the names are right. All right, yeah. At least the names are right. Anyway, let's continue. Alright. Even if I put my mic all the way away from my mouth, it's not really gonna do much. Try to keep it a little bit away from my mouth. But to the extent that you can still hear me. I think I'll go for a half hour with this part. And then I'll then I'll do uh either Empire or Shogun 2 or something like that. I don't know. I've been wanting to do um, a Shogun 2 Let's Play though, so I'll probably do that. Maybe Rise of the Samurai or something. I'm probably gonna do Fall of the Samurai, but for this though, um, I've been I've been wanting to do this, and you know I have to get this out. I mean, I I said I would. I'm, I'm a man of my word. So surreal down here with his kingdom, his freaking Spanish kingdom. Yeah, freaking surreal, showing him I mean, surreal beliefs with his let's play this game of Spain. I vowed that by the end of this let's play that the Norwegian Empire would be bigger than the Spanish Dominion, so we must be bigger than his Spain. I recommend his let's plays to anyone who likes Total War and other games of that nature. pretty good. It's pretty good, let's play. Probably better than me, but, uh, much better than me, actually. He's got, like, a thousand subscribers now, so, you know, that's a little evident. But, you know, I I'm not jealous. I'm not jealous. Goodness. I don't know, it's just every time I see him let's playing something that I'm like, yep, I gotta let's play this. I don't know. I don't know. It, it feels a little bit like a moot, like, copying him, but, like, on one half, I'm. I, it's kind of like I'm copying him. On two, ha on the other half, it's like. It's just you know, it's a. It sounds like a good idea to let's play it, but I don't know. I mean, there is that part of me that feels like I'm copying it, but you know. You know, there's there's that part of me that feels like I'm copying it and feels a little guilty when I do a Let's Play that he's doing. But, you know, I'm thinking, you know, I'll, I'll change this up. I'll play this different country. I'll choose this different mod, you know, try to change it. But in essence, you know, I got the idea from him, so I, I can at least credit him. So I'm not like, you know, I mean, it's not like he owns the game. But I want to at least credit that that's where I got the inspiration to do the Let's Play from. Because otherwise, it's like I'm copying games from him over and over again. Well, it's not like he owns the rights to Let's Playing Napoleon. I'm just saying it's, I don't know, something in my mind doesn't feel right unless I say, oh, he inspired me to do this Let's Play. Go check him out because, I don't know, something in my mind thinks that if I don't, then the world will end in 2012 and, and the world will end at the end of the year and blah, 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 Mayan calendar, blah, 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 Nibiru, blah, 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 Nostradamus, blah, 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 conspiracy theory, new world order, blah, 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 I've nailed them all. I was going to say something about the election, but I don't want to get political. That's for another day. That's not me. I mean, I mean, I do enjoy political discussions, but I don't enjoy political discussion on Let's Plays. I mean, especially when people call, I like, really, when, when I, if I, like, say the Danish dogs or something, I'm not insulting Danish people. In fact, I'm probably part Danish anyway, so I don't, I'm not, 
against anyone in this world. So just, if I make any comment like saying, those darned French, yeah, I'm not, I'm not like racist. I'm just saying like that, those, I'm, I'm only kidding basically. I'm not like serious about it. But, um, I think it's time to begin the war on Denmark now. It's going to be a little hard in the battle because even though we have a full stack army and they have a full stack army, they have a tiny bit more. You know, and you know, I just seen I didn't build a cannon foundry or anything, so I can't get artillery. Well, you know, Christianity and Christiania, Christian is it Christiania or Christiania? If there's anyone Norwegian that knows the if it's Christiania or Christiania or anyone who knows it, uh, let me know, cause I don't know. I can't I can't tell if it's like Christian. Well, it says it has Christian in it, so I'm I'm assuming it's Christiania or something like that. Christiania. Christiania? I don't know. We'll just call it King Chris Castle City thing place. Oh, Greater Pol- I'm- well, the Dukey of Pol- of Warsaw last- and Dukey, I keep saying Dukey. Duchy of Warsaw lasted long. Alright, since, um, they have a pretty large army there. Wow, well, I didn't- I didn't count on that. I'm thinking of like landing my troops in in Jutland and like w waiting for the Danish to come out and face me. Do the Danish have any allies? Yes, they have Sweden. Oh, I think I'll have to invade someone else. Uh, I want to invade someone before the end of this. I want to, you know, make it more eventful. But is there anyone who doesn't have any allies? There's Catalonia, but I don't really want to be Catalonia. There's them. And there's Ireland, but what happened? I thought Scotland got taken over. Oh, whatever. Brittany. Brittany. Well, let's go against my previous game of EU3 that I just played a while back and take over Brittany. I mean, that's not one of my goals. One of my goals in this Let's Play is to take over Scandinavia, but you know, you know, I'm, I'm looking for something that I that I can do and you know the diplomatic situation is just too horrible for me to invade Denmark because I mean th did you see that I mean they were allied with freaking Sweden freaking Sweden and if they went to war with me then that would jeopardize everything yeah I said jeopardize on purpose but um yeah um I don't know it just it just gives me something to show a battle before the end of this uh, part how long have I been going through? Yeah, I'm going to do this live stream just as a test. Um, but if this isn't a good quality video, then I will go back. Because I, I know live stream is a very good quality for recording. So I'm going to see uh, how good the quality for this is. And if it's really, really crappy, then um, I'll just back off and use X-Fire or something. Landing my troops right here. Declaring war right there. And now, let the storming of Rens begin. Is it wrong? I think it's wrong. Rens or Ren? Or, I think it's wrong. Rens. Whatever it is, we're about to take control of it. Holy crap! Er. Uh, yeah, run away, merchantmen! Run away! Oh, you Bretons! Oh no! Oh no! Oh, yep. This is a battle of the freaking century, right there. All right. Let me save. Opportunity to intercept. You know, since there's a bunch of like. Since the Bretons have a lot of troops, I guess we could hit both of them real quick and take them out. If I can hit the, the army that's right next to me first... Oh god, three armies. If I can hit the army that's right next to me first and na knock that out, I can hit the other one and then take that one out and hopefully take them out before they can come in and help each other. Or they'll just all deploy in the same area. That's great. That's just great. That's glorious. Now they can 
they deploy first. Actually, that's, that could be a, an advantage if they deploy first, because then I get to choose based on what they have, what I should, uh, uh, like, where I should set up and where they are. I can use that to my advantage, uh, because now I know where they are, so I can set up accordingly. Oh, okay, good, good, good. What is the, what do they have? They have line, line, four muskets and a hussars. Okay, like a and general, which is also hussars. Like I said, the unit scale is down immensely. That is horrible. Oh my God, I'm thinking of restarting the let's play just because of that, but I'm not gonna. I will make sure that in Empire it will all be big and large because. This this is Darth Maul. It's supposed to be large. There's supposed to be large amounts of troops. I we got gypped. That's all right. It's all right. It's all right. We will we will press on, even though I should have seen this coming. Right. Start the battle. Start the battle. March. Everyone forward. This is the kind of battle I usually fight. Looks like we got mountainous terrain. Yeah, you'll hear a lot of that, the, the, um, the drums and stuff. Okay, what do we got? Over here we have, okay, they're entering here pretty fast. They're coming in pretty fast, but it doesn't look like they have a large enough force to compete with ours. Oh, 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 oh! I hope they can get into position before I need to Oh, oh, bravely waving the flag of Norway over the, over them, uh, the line infantry. Wing. The Bretons are coming in pretty quickly. There's this thing, Norwegian, uh, conquest. Oh god, I think they're charging. Kill them, shoot them, annihilate them, destroy them, please. Yes. Oh, 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 light dragoons, light dragoons. Where's my... On. Uh, do... And you two. What are you doing? Run! I'm one of those people who likes to watch. Likes to watch the men just fight. Yeah. Come on, come on, come on. Oh crap, they're coming around. Where are they going? Are they going straight for the general? No. Yes! Hit them. You go hit them. This is basically what I use for strategy. I kind of just let my infantry sit here in like a line and shoot them while I send my cavalry out to just cause general mayhem. I don't always do that, but that's basically what I'm trying to do. get pretty intense. So I hope you, you're enjoying this. This battle, the titanic struggle between the Norwegians and the Bretons. Those are my 
militia. And uh, where are our. Let's see. Oh, oh, our Knights of Calicia units. Nope. Oh, Christian Division. Surreal Division. The Christian Division isn't named after anyone I know on YouTube. It's just named after, like, a common king name that I've observed in my Scandinavian history. During this time, neither countries were around, so I can't really provide much information about either of them. Except for that the time period did not have this few soldiers on a battlefield, that's my mistake. Man, I don't know why though that that the unit scale is so low. I mean, I have I usually have it set to ultra size. I don't know why it's so small right now. It's probably something to do with Darth Mod. Man, stop yelling! I mean, I'm pretty sure that's just anyone who's wearing headphones like me is gonna die. Dandy volume button on my headset. Just half an hour. Really, only half an hour. I've only been recording. I've only been recording for half an hour. It's longer than that. Whatever. Charge! I think that's everyone. Actually, I think we've run them all down in the field. Oh, yep. Kill those Breton dogs! No, kill them all! Yes. I, want, I actually, like, strategically want them to die, and not just, you know, be crazy and holy mass killings of Bretons. I actually, I actually want to kill them because um, I don't I want as few Bretons around to um, protect the capital as possible. Woot! Following the capture of a capital city, it is important to leave an adequate garrison behind the ground rest until both the population level and any damaged buildings are fully restored. As empty the region for tax may also be never mind. I cannot read the rest. I bet you the Bretons are gonna throw some more troops. No? Well, they were gonna throw some more troops at us. Really, they like all retreated. Wait, did only those guys attack me? Oh, I'm thinking all three of them came in from a realm and came around and tried to attack me, but I fought them all off. I'm actually kind of happy because now I can go take the take out the garrison without any auxiliaries. Wait, the general died? Oh no, that admiral died. Dead admiral. All right, let's go. Surrender or die, never mind. I guess we're doing two uh, two battles in one part. Alright, let's do this. You guys are just getting, just getting spoiled. Back in my day, we didn't get multiple battles in one part. We just got one part with multiple... Just got one part with multiple battles instead of multiple. No, we got multiple parts in one battle. Theodore Requiti, Paul de Forbe, Jean Mathieu Philibert Marigine, and then I have Alf Cephas. Is that Cephas or Savus? I think it's Savus or Savus. Savus. Savas. Savas. I don't know. What is this unit placement? No, no. What is this madness? No. Street. They're kind of they're kind of shaken up a little bit by from a previous battle. I'm still a little annoyed that I that the um, the unit sizes are small. They took the most. Uh, they took the most um, the heaviest beating. 
Nope. They did. They did. They did. They did. Right. No, I'm not gonna order them into the farmhouse. Actually, no. Yeah, go ahead. Get in there. Get in. Get in that house. Get that. Get in that house. Right. Uh, do 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 do. Okay. Let's march out of the field to face these guys. Do, 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 I'm playing as Norway, why am I singing rule, Britannia, why am I singing it? I'll probably let's play Crusader King sometime, why did I just say that before? Yeah, I'm thinking when uh, Crusader Kings comes out, and if, uh, whenever I get it, I'll uh, let's play it. It comes out in a couple days, so, well, actually it's the 7th, so it comes out in like, Seven days, it comes out in a week. So maybe I'll get it on on release date. Hopefully, it'll come out on Steam, so I can so I can get it then. All right, all right, time to run. No, j no, just marching there. Come on, guys, pick up the slack. These guys, I'm just gonna have can't is just just kind of sit out in here because I know their range isn't gonna be as good, but you know why not. Can I have them like there? Yeah, I could actually. I could have them at the wall here. But no, 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 no. You know what? Fine. Fine. I can have them right here. It's like this tiny little addition. Let's see. What do they got? Let's see. Militia, armed citizenry, armed citizenry, lots of armed citizenry, some militia. So, oh, wait, that's not militia. That's line infantry. The Breton flag. It's actually a pretty cool looking flag, I'm gonna admit. I'll admit. I'll admit. Sorry, I had to readjust my headset. Uh, not as awesome as ours, but it's pretty nice. More militia. I can't complain, but, you know, our militia have better hats, so, you know, that's the point. It, this is this is Team Fortress 2. I was watching a stream one time. It was, they were streaming a Judy, some Judy Garland movie. Yeah, so, something with Julie Garland. And, uh, yeah. yeah. When I was watching it, I always remember there were so many hats in the dark movie. We'll speed that up there. Heil Norge. I should not have done that. Right. Heil Norge. There we go. Norska. Norge. Right there. Hear all the random, like, things. Uh, oh, the crap has hit the fan. Harder than Spell Force. Oh, God, Spell Force. I don't know about that game, man. I don't know about that LP. That game, I, I like I like it, but I got Spell Forced out, like, in that one, one like, recording session. I pretty much lost all the effort I had to, uh, to record it. Like, I wanted to let's play it really bad. But that one recording session, that took out all the, all, like, the energy I had for it. Like, all the one I wanted to play it. Like, I, I tried even playing it on my own. I just came, got bored. I think it was just because I had, I was, like, sat there for, like, a straight hour just watching this, this, like, tr tu just doing this tutorial. And it was just, I don't know. It's not that I don't like the game anymore. I don't like the game anymore. I don't know, I just... I just don't want to LP it anymore. I don't have the urge anymore. 
but I, I, I'm still gonna LP it, I just, just don't expect any uh, uploads of that soon. Theoden on acid. Whoa, whoa, why are some people looking backwards? Oh, got lag. That lag. I'm probably still gonna do the uh, Takeda as um in uh, Shogun 2. Oh, this is on all normal difficulty, by the way, I believe. Yeah. So it's like on 100% like normal, normal battle, normal campaign. You know, I, I wanted to make it challenging, but not you know so challenging to the point where I have to rage quit. And oh my god, Georgia rage is is it's not fun. It, it's it it may be fun for you, but it's not fun for me. Especially when I Georgia raged in Mountain Blade about Varfang. Oh my goodness. Oh my god. That made me so unbelievably angry. It's almost as bad as when I Georgia rage in real life. Oh good lord, good lord, that is horrible. I won't even describe it. If you were under the impression that I was going to describe a Georgie Rage in real life, it's like, you, you are horribly mistaken. Go kill him. Charge! For Rohan, I mean, for Norway! Rather, not for Norway. Yeah, not for Norway. Ride for ruin and the world's ending. Do 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 do. Ba 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 ba. You know, I've been meaning to do a Lord of the Rings: The Battle for the World Let's Play, so I might do that. I might even do a playthrough of Lord of the Rings: Conquest. I mean, that game's subpar, but you know, I I I gave it a try. It's okay. It's it's not the greatest game ever, but eh, you know. What do you expect? I mean, it's Lord of the Rings, like, Battle for Middle Fight. Lord of the Rings, like, Battle for Game, so. Oh, yeah, I also discovered a neat little tool. I pressed Insert, and look. Yes, we are riding on horseback. I found that pretty awesome. Now, I think the cavalry are charging. The infantry are going to be charging at us, but let's, let's continue through the eyes of the horsemen. Oh, 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 gonna see a jump. Jump! Like I said, not the. I, well, actually, I didn't say it, but. Not the greatest view ever, but you know, it's a view. Charge! Alright. And we can do that for all of our units, just like these guys. We can see what it's like to be in the surreal, the second, the second regiment of foot of the Norwegian army. So that's pretty awesome. We've killed the general, which makes you pretty happy. Pretty content. Oh, that is... Oh, God. Oh, my God. Are you serious? That... That... Oh, my God. Really? I didn't know that you could do that. I didn't know that you could, like, actually see it through their eyes when they're shooting the gun. That's pretty awesome.
That is pretty awesome. I like that view. Two of them! Stabbing them in the face. Done. Just gonna run into an hour long part. Alright, let's fast forward this. Wait, whoa, 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 what is this? What is this bull crap? No, 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 no. That is, no, that is a lie. Send them after them, men. Send after them the Legion thing and stuff. Men, send in the cavalry. Let's get rid of these guys real quick. Hopefully. I mean, I don't have that many cavalry left, so. Yeah. Either those guys are going to start retreating, or they're going to kill my cavalry. And considering those guys are pretty low morale, I'm thinking the cavalry will come out on top. But, you know, you never know with this freaking game, these games. You can always lose. There's always some way Georgia can end up raging in video games, so... I never said I was good at this game. The entire unit is dead, sir. Yeah, that's right. I'm probably going to lose. But that's alright. That's alright. That's alright. That's all right. You can still do this. I haven't lost yet. Yet. They're running around. Running. Alright, All right, of course. Oh, 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 Only two left. Only two left. Come on, turn around. Turn around, men. Come on, come on, come on, come on, come on, come on, come on. Line up like this. Come on, go, go, go. Glorious victory, sir. Oh, f screw organization. Shoot him, shoot him. Just shoot him. Shoot him in the face. Shoot him in the face, too. Shoot them all in the face. Men with the rifle shoot. The men without their rifle follows the one who has the rifle. When the man with the rifle is killed, the other must pick- I don't know, that just reminded me of that one part of Call of Duty. A good one. The Cod War is the best. My Cod War will be the best game ever. Uh, not in my eyes. The flags clash and the glory The Dookie of Brittany, I mean, du Duchy, sorry, Duchy of Brittany has fallen. I keep saying Dookie because there's Duke. Has fallen and wait, wait, wait. Line up, line up. Come on, men. Victory parade. Victory freaking parade. Come on, get, get in the line. Come on. Get in formation. That's not very good. That's not a very good line, but you know, whatever, whatever. March forward, victory parade. Just so we can get a good shot of the victorious Norwegian army.
Hail Norge, everybody. Let's get out of here. Close victory indeed. It was a it was actually a pretty close battle, and I applaud the Bretons for their for their courage in defending their homeland. But now they're all dead. So what you gonna do? <sighs> right. Say hello to the Norwegian province of Brittany. Oh, now we can recruit Jaegers from here and superior line infantry. Right. So, with that, I think we're good to end this. So, there is the first bit of our Let's Play. Of Let's Play uh, Napoleon Total War with Darth Maud. The Norwegian campaign. Now that that was something I didn't think I was going to do. I th didn't think I was going to declare war on Brittany and take Brittany. But you know what you're gonna do. So that's actually pretty good because now I have somewhere to fall back on in case anyone takes over Norway. So thank you everybody for, and thanks everybody for watching. Have a nice day. This has been Georgie. of the game and who is the king of the Norwegian Empire and for some reason Bel oh yeah Belgium I thought Spain was there because it's Spain's color and empire anyway so thanks everyone for watching those who did watch but then again if you didn't watch you wouldn't be hearing my endless ramblings now would you so uh thanks everybody I th I'm gonna why am I saying that? I have no idea what I'm talking about. Anyway, anyway, before I ramble on for 350 years, before I ra rage on, and, and uh, before I ramble on from 1805 to 2012, let's just end it here. This has been Georgie, and I'm going to go see some stuff about Shogun 2 and Empire, and then upload this video. We'll see you guys. See you next time. I'm zooming in on the North Sea with great intensity. The Kraken! Right, anyway, see ya. I can't remember where my stop recording button was. Let's shift.